Hey everyone, this is James, and this is Ionic Bonding Task Card Set. So if you're looking for a way to take the engagement and motivation to the next level in your classroom, then stick around. So as of the making of this video, there are a total of 60 task cards that come in two versions, an unnumbered version, which you see here in the video, and a numbered version. Now, the reason I provided the numbered version is more so to give you as a teacher the answers so that way, if you want your students to go in the order presented in the numbered version, you can do that. You can always take cards out, or you can print out the unnumbered version and you can number yourself and take the cards that you really don't need because they don't align with your curriculum out. Now, as you see here, the task cards are printed all nice and pretty and beautiful in color. However, if it is not cost effective to you to print in color, you can always print in grayscale and the cards will come out looking just as great as you see here. I also provide a variety of assessment types so that way you can have multiple ways to assess your students. So for example, I have multiple choice questions, as you see here. I have questions that utilize technology where students might have to read something or play an online interactive game. I have some open-ended response questions that have multiple answers, which I provide in the answer key. Sometimes what I'll also do is I'll use this as students are doing stations and I'll have the cards upside down. So I'll have a selected number of cards that I've chosen to quiz students one-on-one -on -one in an oral quiz and they have to pull a card and they'll sit there read it to me and they'll have to answer it so it's another way for me to assess whether or not students are following along in my classroom now as i said earlier there's a variety of different cards that you can utilize to assess your students these are just a couple that i showed here in the video so that is Ionic Bonding Task Card Set. If there's anything about the set that you like, then make sure to hit that like button. And then if you have any questions, comments, or concerns, then leave that in the comment section below and I will do my best to get back to you. And last but not least, if you haven't subscribed, then make sure to do that so that way you can bond with James. As always, thank you for watching.